Okay guys, so here we go. It is finally time to hop in and complete our Monster Jam Steel Titans World Championship playthrough. It has been a while, it has been literally like forever, but you know what? I'm late night gaming, I was like, it is time to finish up this series. So I really want to actually hop in and do some crazy wild things within this game, just because I think like the free roam aspect and, and different modes within this game are actually crazy. The career mode is pretty limited. I think we can have fun within the other game modes, exploring free ride and doing crazy things in the arcade modes. So that's the plan after today, after the finale. We're going to be doing some wild things, but we got some business to take care of first. It is time to be crowned the king of Monster Jam Steel Titans. Let's get into the video. Alright guys, so just a little bit of a recap. Coming in to this episode, I was actually only 62% of the way through this series. If you go back to the last Monster Jam video that I actually uploaded, man, it was, it was a while ago, and yeah, it was to complete 62% of the championship. That's where we were standing. So basically, I went ahead and completed five rounds, five insane rounds filled with chaos, carnage, crazy moments, disappointments, possibly the craziest moment ever in a head-to-head -head race where like, man, I crashed but kept going, somehow rode away and won the head-to-head -head in Detroit. It was wild and yeah, it, it was carnage to say the least. Five rounds of carnage. I basically dominated the two-wheel skill events and the freestyle events at every stadium. Those were a piece of cake. But the head-to-head -head races definitely had some heartbreaking moments where I took big old L's. I actually got knocked out in round two at my home track in Toronto, man. A disappointment. I wanted to perform for the home crowd, but uh, not happening today. And at the previous round, Wilkes Bear, I actually took a even bigger L and lost right off the bat. So that brings us here. It's time to hop into Las Vegas, head-to-head -head event, two-wheel skill events, and then freestyle to end it off. So it should be fun. It is the finale. We have the points lead. Hopefully, I can continue on dominating and we can end off this series with a bang. So I've actually only played on Las Vegas once. And that was, man, that was a while ago. So hopefully the two-wheel skill events don't cause me any trouble, but this head-to-head -head event is probably gonna cause me a little more trouble than that. Where are we going here? Okay, turn, 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 turn. All right, going pretty good so far, but I really feel like once we actually finish this career mode, this championship, man, we're gonna be able to do whatever I want to do in this game. So if you guys have any crazy ideas that you want me to, to I mean, see if they're possible or if you want me to do anything wild within this game let me know in the comments below because i do feel like the career mode actually limits you like content wise just because you're only doing head to head two wheel skill and then freestyle events and you don't get into doing any of like the outdoor events or anything crazy on that note so i don't know i just feel like the career mode is really long this world championship is Wow, it's like basically every event that I did previously into one championship. So I really, really, really wanted to do the finale for you guys, but I did not want to have to do like six episodes to get to the finale. So that's why I went ahead and actually did some playing off camera and got here to Las Vegas with that points lead. So I played like, like I said, five rounds off camera to get here and I wanted to get this championship out of the way. If you guys do enjoy the Monster Jam content, make sure to smash that thumbs up button for me. Throw any comments down below. If you guys have any questions, comments, or concerns, comment section is where you guys should leave them. Other than that, man, other than that, subscribe for a ton of off-road content we are always doing. Just random off-road videos. I'm gonna try and just be very creative with my content going forward, especially after we hit 10,000 subs. So 
We're on the 10,000 sub grind. Make sure you guys click that subscribe button if you haven't already. Help me out. Help me reach 10k. And uh, yeah, just having fun in Monster Jam. Like I said, if you guys have any wild ideas, let me know in the comments below. Because Monster Jam, it's a fun game. I just feel like I'm kind of burnt out on the career mode and it's time to switch it up. Alright, this is the finale. This is for all the marbles. Actually, being here, the fourth round, if you make it this far, it means you're either getting first or second in the head-to-head -head event. So, that's pretty good, right? Can't complain about that. I'm just gonna try and, I mean, cruise to the finish line. We're going against Megalodon. And hopefully... I don't know, I hope they do some wild cutscene or something at the end when we take the final win in that freestyle event. Hopefully I can dominate. It would be a disappointment to, uh, <laughs> in the final round, I mean, win the championship but not perform very good. That would kind of suck, so hopefully I can continue on doing what we're doing and getting those wins now it's time for the two wheel combo i want to see if maybe i can uh, get up into a wheelie or maybe not actually what i'll do just for fun boom stoppy oh <laughs> wow pop it up into a wheelie there we go do you guys remember this do you guys remember this i love cheating the system we can just sit here all day all day long just wait wait on the back of the truck and uh, basically pull off the biggest two-wheel combo ever. Now, I do feel like this is kind of cheating. Like, I mean, kind of, kind of cheating? That's definitely cheating. Exploit. Maybe not cheating, but it's definitely exploiting the game. Am I right? So, maybe not cheating. Definitely not cheating, but yeah, I feel like the Tifu of uh, <laughs> Monster Jam when I do that because if you guys know Tifu, you guys know that he is like the king. He is the king of exploiting games and uh, that is something. Wow, okay, failing that attempt, but Tifu is the king of exploiting games and clearly that exploit was <laughs> good enough to get me the win. So let's go. You guys see that timer in the top left hand corner of the screen? Two minutes. That means two minutes until we are crowned the world champion in Monster Jam. That's exactly what that means right now. All I have to do, I don't even think I have to actually do good. I don't even think I have to perform. The only reason I want to do good is uh, for myself, so that I feel good about myself being a champion. Like I said, wouldn't it be kind of embarrassing, like, getting absolutely destroyed at an event, yet you walk away the champion? I've always thought about that, like, Supercross, Motocross, doesn't really matter what it is. You can win a championship, but do terrible at the last event. And I just feel like, like, being a champion, you should show up and perform and be like, yeah, this is why I'm a champion, not like... Yeah, this is me finishing in last- wow, I keep doing that, man. Landing on my roof. It reminds me of the OG Gravedigger days. Do you guys remember when I was always a Gravedigger? Just landing on my roof 24-7? I thought this truck was a little better for it, but man, it's definitely causing me a little bit of trouble. Six times combo right now. We're working our way towards the top step of the podium. I actually don't know if we're gonna do it. 30 seconds on the clock. It's not much time. Crush those cars. Get into a big old backflip. Wow, that was um, a big backflip. <laughs> 15 seconds on the clock. I actually don't know if we're gonna get this one done. We need to try and get up there and beat Zombie. I do... I mean, I would love to walk out of here with a first place but if it doesn't happen it doesn't happen it happened let's go it happened <laughs> and that's it guys i'm gonna have to see if there's actually like a final cutscene or anything but that's it when i started this recording session at 62 percent of the way through this championship i had i had no money so to get 20k from those six rounds not too bad and that right there is a look at the final point standings 598 points i was two points away from hitting 600 dang we had a 74 point lead at the end that is insane and this is it this is what we get to see 
for winning the World Championship Series. We got Max D Gold, Whiplash, and 60k? 60k for winning? Let's go. Is that it though? That's like, that's pretty anticlimactic, don't you think? You do all of that. All of those races just for that little, not even a cutscene or anything. Just like, congrats, you won. Here's 60k. Wow. But now, we have the whole entire free roam map. We can take on Titan's Grove. We can take on Old Soda Springs. We can just get crazy with it. And now I think, like I said, the content options, the options for content are gonna start to open up. The career was pretty limited. This is gonna be wild. Monster Jam is just getting started here on the channel. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, smash that thumbs up button for me. Subscribe if you are new around here and I will catch you guys all in another video. Peace out.